Hello everyone, I'm Gordon Howell from the UK. Today I'd like to introduce you to someone very special, it's Mina. Now Mina represents Delacorte's quest for innovation to make the barista's life easier in terms of their ability to produce a consistent cup, irrespective of their regional or national preferences on style or strength. Mina has three operational control buttons, one for steam, one for function selection, and then the yoke system for manual mode. Mina has a series of visual aids, one for shot selection, one and two, one for water dispense, milk control system, and one to engage the yoke system. Whether we're engaging the yoke system or an automatic, we have a series of lights to show which flow setting we're on. We also have a coffee pressure gauge, and this is very important because it shows the flow rate, how that has affected the pressure in terms of how it's reached pressure and when it reaches pressure. To get the very best out of Mina, we have to connect to her and use the app. This unleashes her potential to make it better because it gives us visibility and control over the following functions. For more information, please see our app video. What happens today when we make an espresso? We focus on the things that we control, the grind, the temperature, the brew recipe. But once we've done that, we press the button and the machine takes over. So we have very little insight, control or visibility of what's actually happening in the extraction process. Mina has lots of powers, but her superpower is the ability to manipulate and control flow. This is done digitally through a DFR, which is her digital flow regulator. And this is simply like a digital tap controlling fast or slow movements of water, similar to how we would control a tap or shower at home. Why this is important is currently we only have one flow rate with no visibility and no control. It tends to be aggressive, which means the time for pre-infusion and infusion is low. This normally leads to inconsistent extraction. We know from hand brewing the way that we present water to the coffee has a massive impact on the end beverage in terms of its taste and texture. Through Mina we want to explore those possibilities of making our espresso taste better. So Mina's usability, we're very lucky and fortunate that she has an auto calibration system that dials in nine settings from soft being one and nine being aggressive. We also have five steps that are controlled digitally that we can introduce time against each step which gives us great ability to control flow consistently. Mina allows for fully automated profiling, semi-automatic profiling where we can control just volume and fully manually profiling where we use the yoke. So a basic introduction to flow profiling. On caption one, you'll see a traditional flow profile with one flow setting. On a caption two, you will see us engaging Mina's technology and digitally controlling a stepped flow profile in terms of flow and time in five steps. Please don't be fooled by Mina's petite appearance. She is one of the most advanced and powerful machines on the market today. She can create millions of flow profiles at the touch of a button. This gives us greater control and visibility over the pre-infusion and infusion process of making an espresso. Have fun and make it better. Thank you.